Aloha. This is the Green Lightning Mr. T. Last episode, I did a lot of gathering stuff, preparing for the next world, dealing with cheats, getting grabbing swap and stop stuff. I actually want to real quick check how many of these. Yeah, I got enough for another um honeycomb piece, so let's go grab it. And there we are. So we won't be back for a while now. Probably in, at least until we get to the next three worlds, in fact. Okay, one thing to note about this over here. As a kid, when I first was playing through this game, I could not, for the life of me, f find this thing. I had no idea of, it, of, it, of its existence. I just plain totally missed it. And it ca that caused a lot of problems with progressing for the game, of course. But this was another one of those milestones that I got stuck at. Finding this thing. It is just kind of sitting here, but I thought I would access the next area. Like at the Pine Grove. Since that was the last area you could access. I thought it, it would be from there that I go to the next area. It wasn't. So what new egg thing do we get today? Okay. So now we have ice eggs. They're basically the same thing as fire eggs, damage-wise, but of course they freeze instead of burn. Really good at stopping your enemy cold. Okay. Are there any? Yeah, I think there's some note. Yeah, I think I know where some notes are around here. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what to talk about yet. I've been. Oh! Crazy guy. Um, I've been. I don't know, I've been working on my schoolwork, basically. And that's kept me busy. I'm not sure if I'm going to be streaming this weekend, and if this, I mean, this video will be up during the weekend, so whether or not I stream then is irrelevant at that point, I guess. But, I don't know. Depends if I have time this weekend. Alright. On to... Head over here and just grab these notes, just because I can. I love that door. Okay, so that's all the notes. And then there's also a Globo. This one for the overworld. However, there's no reason to use it yet, so... I'll just hang on to it and I'll have an extra Globo. Which may or not come in handy when I need Mumbo or Wumbo. <laughs> did, did I just do that? <laughs> uh, did, did I seriously just say Mumba and then Wumbo? <laughs> what is wrong with me? <laughs> <laughs> what did I? 
I, I, oh god, what am I doing? Okay, um... You do it from the other side, I guess? Where the crack is? There you go. Whatever. We're bad! So welcome to Jolly Rancher's Bay. It took me over to figure out these things, but... There's the balloons! Whenever you see any of these things, you can drill beak it. Once again, showing how much the drill beak is used in this game. Because there's actually quite a th bit of things to do um, up here before we eventually, which we will, um, head underwater. This is basically a water level. A very good one at that. Okay, um, sure, let's do this now. So, over here... By the way, one thing you note, know, most peak characters in this game will talk to Banjo but most characters won't actually talk to Kazooie unless you have Banjo with her because they're jerks. <laughs> and that's basically it. That's all I can say. <laughs> so now we have the... Wing attack. I don't remember what you called it exactly, but we can do that, and we can also spin, but while moving. The spin while move. The spin can kind of work as an extra distance factor, I guess, because you don't fall while you're you're doing it. Well, at least not that much. And then you can go straight into flapping your wings. Okay, so apparently those guys are one of the- I don't think he can talk to... The... Blubbo? Is that the name? Hmm. Well, at any rate. Okay. So, also this. That uh, was not right. I didn't get the honeycomb. What's up with that? Okay, so over here, I believe, we, yes, we have a thingy majiggy. An empty honeycomb piece. <sighs> I don't know. I, there's so much I didn't know as a kid. Okay, so. Let's do- oh. Well, there's a sign that I didn't actually- I failed to read, but whatever. This is how you get fix their pollution problem. We go to another world! That'll work. Okay. Help. Help. What? That doesn't fix the 
the co plot problem because yes, they care about the fact that the water is, is cold. That is an issue to their minds. Oh, I got the wrong ones. Oh well. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Stuff under here. And this is the world where it's really nice to have the swimming technique. If I can actually grab the, the balloon, there we go. Okay, where do we go now? Guess over here will work. Captain Blubber! Blubber! Blubber, that's it! that he talks and burps. <laughs> like... Ugh. I don't know. It was funny at one point. So, those shoes were his last possession. They didn't even fit him. Okay, so that's not all that's in here. There's a couple of notes, and I believe a Jinjo. I could be wrong about the Jinjo, though. I don't hear it, actually. Nope, he's there. Okay. So these do have a use, and that's, if you guys remember, you can run on water now. If that wasn't already a thing, I still don't remember. Okay. That takes care of almost everything. That would be a good time to head over here. Oh, grab that. Although I'm pretty sure we would just grab it on the way out anyways. Automatically. Okay. I didn't do it! <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> yeah, you. They, no one seems to notice that that just got blown up. No one really cares! <sighs> Keep flipping into his hat. Wonderful. Ooh. 
Also, we can enter a room. We could blow the door off and go in for free, but... It's nicer to be nice, isn't it? I don't care. <laughs> so now we can use eggs underwater. And we'll be needing that. Also, this guy who is in a photo, pic, uh, portrait of the last in the last game, but not much else. <laughs> and fun thing, if we keep talking with him. It'll get something. everything and also there's fo photos of like stuff in the previous games that's not cool anyways that's pretty much all we can do here so the last place to go over here wait did I actually grab those or did I forget yeah, but I f yeah, I f figured I was missing a couple of doubloons that I should already have. The, b the balloons. Oh, close enough. <laughs> Pretty sure I com totally missed that, but eh, whatever. Okay, so Mumbo has a big part in this level, but all you only need to use him at the beginning. Also, probably. Very um, questionable use, at least by some people. I mean, this power could work. Technically. It's a video game. He's using spells. Why? Where's? Why is? Are people questioning the logic of him using magic rather than the fact that of his what is how his magic works? Why is that such a big deal? Okay. So he's got one and one purpose in this game. And I mean this world. Sunlight. He uses sunlight to oxygenate the water. Now people have gone nuts over this for ages. Now here's my theory. Because yes, I'm going to defend it. Um, the sunlight is so good that it reaches all the the, the grass green stuff, seaweed and stuff on the bottom, and then produce so much oxygen that the water can be breathed. 
and drank at the same time. So you're oxygenating yourself by drinking. That's one big bathroom trip. Anyways, well, that's all I got really. And that's all we need Mumbo for. So before we end off, I would like to finish up up here. Now that I've gotten all every possible the balloon. And there's the actual global I'm supposed to use. But having the other one saved me a bit of time. I feel like I just kind of, I, I didn't even see the jig yet. I forgot it was there. Okay, now he's got to get a new case for the next thing he hits. he's gonna sell. Alright, so let's leave and come back. Probably would. <laughs> okay, so that takes care of pretty much everything above ground that we can do at the moment. So this has been the Green Lenning Mr. T. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. And to you I say, Aloha!